with that, now we'll go ahead and jump into how you would actually post one of these out to the job board. And we did this in a particular re order um, because these assessments and these candidate forms are actually selected as we go ahead and post them out to our job boards. And so as a quick review, again, here getting into our settings, um, up in the top right, we can go to that wrench and screwdriver. And I'll go through this quickly because we touched on it earlier, but under that job board setting, we can choose what we want to have turned on. So, you know, maybe we want to post a job out to the career site. And then down here, maybe we want to post to, you know, maybe the big three, uh, Glassdoor, Google, and Indeed. So we have all of those turned on and ready to go. And now we're actually ready to get our job posted out to those different sources. And so it's pretty easy to do. We'll go ahead and jump over to our job openings module and we'll open up the job opening that we wanna post. From there, up in the top right, there's this little publish button. It's green when you hover over it, but it, it'll just be white when you look at it by default. And so using this publish button, that'll open us up to a new page where we can actually choose which jobs we wanna post this out to. So because these were the three that we had turned on at the time of this posting, those are the ones that are gonna be available for us to actually send this out. And now that we've chosen our different job boards, now we kind of get into the specifics here. So I could say in order to apply for this job on one of these job boards, you need to fill out the developer assessment form, not just the standard candidate application form. So I can choose that. And then I can also choose what assessment they should fill out upon, you know, wanting to apply for this job through the job board. And so in this case, I'll go ahead and choose our developer assessment because um, that's the one that is the best fit for this opening. And then from there, we are pretty much ready to get this published. And so we can go ahead and publish it out just down here at the bottom. And then one little thing to note, because this might trip you up a little bit, is you know with Indeed, because it is a sponsored posting, you have to have some kind of budget on file um, with Indeed for it to be able to post. That budget can be very, very small. I forget exactly what it is. It's like five or ten dollars. So if you wanted to just do the minimum, you just you know put a five dollar budget. You'd say I'm only willing to pay you know five cents per applicant or five cents per click, right? Just to give it something in the tank to get it posted out there. If you don't really want to put a big budget behind um, deploying this, but you still want to get it integrated uh, through recruit and through that job board posting. Just a little trick for you guys, if if you do bump into that, you know, you don't need to put a big budget at all. We've had plenty of clients just do a couple dollars a month just to basically turn this on. Um, and the, you know, added little benefit of that is that it will actually promote your post on Indeed. So you'll show up a little bit above any free postings that Indeed might have running uh, independent of a sponsorship.